All right, let's go. Back's in here. Okay, we're gonna work on our dropping, our stepping, and our holding a little bit. We're gonna get two balls going, make good angles, no square passes, all right? Let's just move the ball quickly. Here we go. Here we go, Red. Here we go. Listen now. If you play a ball in to the, to the midfielders, it's gotta be at an angle. Step up, step up. win it. Expand, yep. I, I like the, the mentality of our team. I, I think we've got a lot of hard workers. They're very motivated. Um, and uh, I think they're, they're driven to, to see if we can't get a little further, obviously, than we, we did last year. Good ball, Kristen. The Virginia women's soccer team returns five starters from last year's College Cup squad that fell to eventual national champion UCLA in penalty kicks in the final four. Last year kind of put it in real perspective, uh, very you know, clear focus about what needs to be done and uh, what we're capable of doing, and I think that's always a good thing. Even though that we lost a, a significant chunk of that team, I still think there's the core of players that return that, that have that confidence and they can instill that with the younger players. We still have to gel, which is what we're doing now. We still have to make that happen on the field a little bit more. But I think the, you know, the expectation hasn't changed. We want to not only get back to the College Cup, but we want to win it. And uh, that's been our expectation every year. We've got a good group of young players. I think they're all working very hard and uh, they all want to be a part of it and they're all unselfish and want to play for the team. On the back line, the Cavaliers have to replace graduated players Shasta Fisher, Molly Menchel, and Morgan Stiff. The bulk of our players that we lost last year were from the back line, but I still think we've got some good players, including Emily, Kristen McNabb, Morgan Stearns, Julia Soroba that I think can help us. It's not the most glamorous position in terms of stopping opportunities and keeping teams from scoring goals and ball winning and those kinds of things, but uh, we, we have a very good core of players. The midfield returns reigning Herman Trophy winner Morgan Bryan. However, Brian will be participating with the U.S. women's national team throughout the fall in preparation for CONCACAF qualifying in the middle of October. You know, Morgan coming in and, you know, coming back with us and then leaving for, with the national team throughout the fall, it's going to be a challenge for us. We, we understand that. But I, I wouldn't say that it's not something we're not used to. I mean, we, she's been in and out of the team, I think, for the past three years. So we're kind of, we're kind of used to it. I think the team's used to it a little bit more. We'll just miss her talent and her ability on the field. So I think we've got some good players and some our team, I think, collectively can step up and do a good job in her absence. All these are short passes. Make good angles to each other and move the ball quick. It's about moving the ball fast, OK? Let's get it from one spot to the other. Go. Here you go, Jules. You need depth to win a national championship, and you need depth to, to go far in the postseason. And so, um, we've 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 been fortunate to have that kind of depth. We've been fortunate that our players buy into the team concept, and uh, we've been fortunate they, that that our team really just cares about what's best for the team at this time. How can we be successful? How can I help the team be successful? What can I do to to fulfill my role to the best of my ability? And, and to have a positive attitude in the process. And we've been very good. I mean, the, the, I think the character qualities of our players have been exceptional. And I think that's been a, a big part as much as the depth. We have players that, like I said, have been experienced, that, that know what, what's um, to be expected. And uh, they've worked very hard to get to this point. So it's a matter of them coming in and stepping in and, and fulfilling the role. And I, I'm very confident in those players pleased with, the, with their efforts so far and, and really feel this team has a lot of potential to, to do some good things at the end.